Hello everyone. Here we go. Today I'm gonna to be doing another gonna be doing another brand new reaction film. And this time I'm reacting to the Call of Garby, aka Astronomy of his on his channel Astronomy of the of a video of his that he uploaded four days ago. And the bell video I am reacting to is called If You Ever See Freddy Fast Fair, Rest Him Immediately, Monster Bond Bounty Hunters. So yeah, I'm gonna react to it. So now about Freddy, let's get the video right now. What the hell is going on, guys? Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day, guys. I know I'm sorry. It's been weeks since I've uploaded. I've turned into the next David. This guy nah. is setting records for the laziest YouTuber there is. What? Stromity Squad. We're coming back strong. We're here in Arizona. And if you guys remember anything about Arizona from the last time we were here, it is that some crazy it goes down in this state, right. guys. I'm not just picking up the camera for no reason. We woke up to something absolutely crazy on our door. So, guys, I was about to go on my morning routine, grab my morning coffee, when I opened the door and I noticed this. What? Bro, who the hell is Freddy Franchiser? Wait, what kind of name no, is that? David. Fair, dude. Where the hell did you get Freddy Franchiser? Are you out of your freaking mind? David. It clearly says Freddy Fazbear. Yeah, and Freddy if you know Fazbear. anything about Freddy Fazbear, he is one of the most relentless monsters out there right now. His movie just came out. And guys, yeah. Donna knows all about the Freddy Fazbear history. Okay, so this guy is not good at all. Basically, what he does is he lures people, especially into his pizza place, makes it look all fun and exciting, and then he just traps you in there, and you're basically stuck forever. So, 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 so stuck forever? Yeah, trust me, it gets even worse because sometimes he turns you into one of his actual puppets. And so one, wait, so we're gonna end up looking like oh, this? Oh, no, people who have been kidnapped literally end up looking like that. I mean... They look like children's toys. Guys, I've heard a <laughs> lot of crazy yeah. on this channel, but that has to be top three. Imagine going into this Freddy Fazbear's pizza right. place and he ends up kidnapping you and turning you into one of his animatronics. You would literally become his slave for eternity. And then you would even have to lure other victims, even though obviously you don't want to into the pizza place it's an endless cycle yeah. pyramid scheme for luring people into the pizza parlor bro we need to find this guy and put an end to his craziness guys they've recently sent out job applications for people who want to work as a security guard at the real freddy fazbear's pizza place and literally nobody wants to do it i mean i don't blame them if you saw the yeah. movie then you would know why that's a terrible <laughs> idea but yeah, somebody squad you guys know here on this channel we are the most savage youtubers out there and if this video gets a hundred thousand likes we will literally go in and apply for the security job position at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Place. How crazy is that? <laughs> well, yeah, crazy. maybe you can count me out of that, bro. We're literally walking right into danger and you're saying 100k is what it takes? Is your life worth 100,000 likes? Dude, I would do just about anything to get 100,000 likes, even if it means that I have to put my life on the line. As a matter of fact, I would die. For a hundred thousand likes. Yo, Kyle, oh, you know that's just a bit over the top. Just take it down a couple notches. Weren't you telling me earlier that you didn't want to go as, you know, crazy in all your videos? You want to take it a bit more serious? What the hell was that? I don't know, dude, but something about the likes just gets me going. Mm -hmm. But anyway, Stromity Squad, the Arizona Bounty Hunting Association has put out wanted posters all over the city. People are waking up to these posters literally everywhere. It says, wanted, last seen in the Superstition Mountain. If you know anything about the Superstition Mountains, I mean, it's literally in the name. There yeah. are a bunch of urban legend myths that have right. to do with this mountain, and people have a lot of superstitions about it. If there is one place in Arizona that you do not want to go, it right. is these mountains. And I think it's for that reason that Freddy Fazbear is hiding out in those right. mountains right now because the whole city is hunting him right now, mm -hmm. and that would probably be his safest bet. On one right. side of things, yes, it would be stupid for us to go there right now, <laughs> yeah. but on another side of things, they are literally offering $10,000 if we can capture him alive and bring him into the Arizona Bounty Hunting Association. Yo. It is worth it. Dude, think, think about, about what it. we could buy with ten thousand dollars. Yeah, that's just get out alive. Bro, but think about it. Ten thousand dollars, that's... We'd be millionaires. <laughs> Thousandaires. Uh, David, the math just isn't math. You have gotten a lot dumber since Toronto, dude. I don't know about you, but I'm not uh, gonna sit here and let some other idiot get in between me and my ten thousand oh, dollars. So Jesus. strong squad, we're gonna try to capture this guy. And if you're ready for this, go down below, drop a like, hit that subscribe button, guys. We're almost at eight million subscribers. Yeah. <laughs> We Almost gained 8 2 million. million subscribers in the last month. Guys, that is literally unheard of. Can we get to 10 million? That's up to you, but without further ado, what, let's what, what, get, get down to there. All right, 
right, Strawberry Squad, we were on our way to the Superstition Mountains when all of a sudden Nighthawk took an absolute spill. The tire pressure dropped from full to flat in seconds. Guys, look at this. It's almost like something in the universe is telling us not, not to go to the Superstition Mountains. Yo, what did I say about these mountains? You're right, bro. I mean, huh? literally, you have owned this car for about two to three years now, and I've never, never had ever a had a flat tire. The one day we're going to the Superstition Mountains, the one place in Arizona that people claim you should never go, of course this happens, dude. Maybe Listen, we're not meant to go to the spot. Listen, maybe this is the universe protecting us from something super bad that's about that's to happen. That's what I'm saying, bro. I'm a huge believer in God, and when God gives me signs, I yeah. listen, bro. I'm out. And with that being said, guys, we're calling the Tesla service. They're gonna swap oh. the tire, and we're gonna continue with the mission. One. Oh, All right, Stromedy Squad, yeah. and right over there, you can see the Superstition Mountains. Up ahead, we're making progress. Clearly, we were not meant to go here today because of the flat tires, so let's yeah. hope nothing bad happens. But at this point, we're gonna oh, want to yeah, keep our nothing, eyes nothing and ears peeled happens. because the poster just gave us a general idea on as to where Freddy Fazbear was seen last, so he could literally be anywhere in yeah. this area. Yo, guys, keep your eyes open. Dude, this is a huge mountain. Yeah, it's like um, looking for oh, a wait. needle in a haystack. How are we gonna find this guy? I have no idea, but it's 1 p.m. right now, which means we have six hours to find wait. Freddy Fazbear and claim this $10,000 reward. The good thing about being in the desert is there's no trees that he could hide under, oh, especially wait. if we take the drone up to cover way more ground. Oh, it yeah. should be a lot easier to try to find him. But yeah, I will pick the camera up if we notice anything. <laughs> All right, Stromedy Squad, and we have made uh -huh. it to the superstition mountain yo this place is absolutely yeah. insane look around us guys we are literally in the middle of nowhere so if anything happens to us we are quite literally oh, yeah. yo, wait, what were you saying earlier this article says in the early 1800s apache believed that this area was inhabited by dangerous spirits that would haunt the locals so not only do we got to worry about freddy fazbear but we got to worry about dangerous spirits possessing <laughs> us so at any given point in time david could literally start levitating like oh, oh, oh. <laughs> i'm gonna like that one we are already off to a bad start, but guys, don't even ask us why we're wearing these bulletproof vests. We are literally wearing them for no other reason than to just oh, look sick. You guys know here on this yeah. channel, it's less Probably about being smart protection. and more about looking sick. The sicker we can look, the better. But guys, we've already killed about two hours. It took us a while to get here. We are burning time. We're going to get the drone up in the air, and we're going to take it all across the <laughs> desert, especially near the Superstition Mountains, which are right over there, which is where Freddy Fazbear has been reported to have been seen. All right, yeah. Strawberry Squad, we have the drone ready to go. We're going to launch this up in the air. We all know what we're looking for. Freddy Fazbear is somewhere in the area, yeah. so... Right off the bat, that is absolutely insane. Look you at the scenery. Wait, wait, you didn't say we have takeoff, bro. The Strongest no. Squad's waiting. Oh, yeah. And as always, we have takeoff. Yeah. Without further ado, let's take the drone all around this surrounding desert area. So, guys, look, there's already, like, a bunch of houses over here. And oh. this is kind of making me think that Freddy Fazbear could be living in one of these houses. Well, maybe now. he's, like, living in the area because he likes to prey on the people in the town. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. This is the perfect place to do it because... Because a lot of people are scared to come to this area. I can't imagine being one of these people living in a house right next to the Superstition Absolutely. Mountains with all the missing people that have been reported, things going wrong. There's so many, like, urban legend myths. This area is known for some really bad stuff. So, Strawberry Squad, we're looking for Freddy Fazbear. He looks like a bear. So, yeah. the problem is, is he has, like, kind of, like, a beige outfit. So, it's going to be hard. But He's going to camouflage in with the same. Do you guys realize that this guy is about eight feet tall? Like, These are ginormous just, animatronics. Like, like they're humongous. When you look at them, we're going to be looking like this. Yeah, so my question is, is it really an animatronic? Like or could this just be some loot? Lunatic dressed up as Freddy Fazbear who think thinks so? he's the real him. You know what I'm saying? Because the movie is like really popping off right now, so maybe there are people who are like getting influenced by it, you know? Yeah, hundred percent. Okay, I don't know where to focus my efforts right now. This town is absolutely massive. Do you think one of these homes is Freddy Fazbear's house? Or maybe Freddy Fazbear's pizza place is here. That would be crazy. Yeah, it might be in the area. Because remember in the movie, like it was in the middle of nowhere. Okay, there are so many places to look. I really don't even know where to start, Stromedy Squad. But the drone is our best bet because we have. Yeah. Absolutely zero chance trying to find. Yeah. Oh, I do apologize. I got an ad. No, I do apologize for that. We have absolutely zero chance trying to find him on foot. Oh, like, on foot, we would not find anything. Oh, yeah. How big this place is? That would be absolutely insane. No. Okay, guys, we're going to go to the mountains because you remember on the wanted poster, it said he was last seen in the Superstition Mountains. Could mean anywhere nearby? <laughs> do you think that means anywhere nearby or do you think he's actually hiding like inside the mountains? I mean, who knows? It could be anywhere nearby. This guy's huge and also he doesn't want to be caught so he could be hiding in the mountains. That's the best bet. Yeah, 100%. Where, it's, like where he's least 
likely to be caught, you know, especially if he knows that there's a huge bounty on his head right now. Like, he knows lunatics like us are trying to hunt him down <laughs> yeah, right now. Yeah. yeah, we definitely gotta be careful, but yo, how mm. sick would it be if I could get over top of this mountain right now? So let's keep in mind here, we're not just looking for Freddy Fazbear. The amount of things we could find in yeah. this mountain, I mean, yeah, that is the options are endless. Yeah. We're also very close to a government facility that likes to do UFO things, you know? Right. Oh, yeah, guys, we're not too far from Area 51 so... and all that crazy stuff, too, so... This whole area yeah. has a weird energy, that's for sure. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, look how high I am right now. I'm oh, literally yeah. at the max altitude. The drone won't even, it won't even go any higher, but... Yeah, I want to see. Yo, look oh, at this. Geez. Oh, my God. I'm, like, right over by the mountain. Yo, look he at that view. That is nuts, yo. Yo, that this is, is very, absolutely very, very crazy. Nuts. He could literally be anywhere in this area. This drone yeah. literally saved us a whole height. Imagine we saw him right there at the top of the mountain right now. <laughs> you know what we should investigate? We should go down below and try to see, like, inside the little crevices and cracks. Maybe yeah. there's yeah, a cave me, that he could be like hiding in. This is, like, a very hard area to hike. It looks like not many people would, like, be around there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know about okay, you, guys, we're I just gonna like circle that. the mountain and try to see if we can see anything. Guys, if you notice anything, you know the drill. Comment yeah. it down below. Uh, those are some really high drops. Yeah, I gotta really make sure I do not crash the drone here. Yeah, but don't crash the drone. Oh, I'm don't crash the drone, Kyle. Yeah. There's no Imagine. chance. You know, usually we say, like, yeah. we do not want to have to go and get it and put ourselves <laughs> at risk like that. Like, yeah. there's, this time, there's no chance. There's not. I don't, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, oh, like maybe in there? Do oh, you see yeah. that crevice? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, there's a million crevices. Yeah, that though. is there's true. 45 billion places he could potentially be. I'm so. also wondering, do you think he's completely alone in this? There's no way he's doing I mean, all he has this his other animatronics, alone. right? But he forces them to do his dirty work, yeah. right? Because those are the kids that have died, and he forces yeah. their spirits into Absolutely. those animatronics. So he's already hiding out and keeping it safe, while other... Yo, this drone looks something straight out of a movie. You see that? It's insane. Well, that is I'm not gonna say that does not look like Planet Earth. If you haven't seen the edge, seen the fight next to the face, go. Okay, okay, yeah, I'll try to get in there. You won't see it yet, but I did my movie review if you haven't yet, so go and check it out. If you haven't seen the film, go and check it out. So. Guys, I don't think we've ever explored a cooler spot than this. I wish the drone could get up a little higher because then we could check the top of the mountain. But I don't think he would be at the top of the mountain because if there was like bounty hunter helicopters looking for him, that's the first spot they would be able to see, you know? Yo, David, you've said absolutely nothing to contribute to the entertainment value of this video, dude. Do you have anything to say for yourself? Yo, I'm actually starting to think, yo, what if this whole thing is actually a ploy? Like, he's the one that had his little minions go around, put out the bounty posters, and he's literally just warring us out to the mountain where there's no one around so he can do whatever he plans. If you are Dang right, then we're so really stupid. Or what if he got a bunch of costumes that look like him and he paid a bunch of people to go out to this area so that they get reports of him being in the Superstition Mountain area, but that was all really just a diversion and he could be somewhere completely different. If he's like watching, uh, he sees us, but we don't see him. If he sees us, then we 100% should be able to see him, right? Bro, I would assume that he knows these mountains better than we do because, yo, we're literally from Canada. We rarely come here and we are not familiar with the area, bro. So what I'm saying is we might be absolutely out of our luck here. I say we just land this drone and, you know, go back home. David, do you want $10,000 or not? Dude, imagine the Lamborghinis and the houses we could buy with that. Bro, it's only $10,000. You're acting like the prize money is... A couple mil, bro. You need to take it down and, you know, bring your dreams about here. Wait, dude, never mind that. Yo, check out this town, dude. This looks like something straight out of a Clint Eastwood movie. Yo, look, it's like some Whoa. old western oh, town. Yeah. Yo, that's <laughs> absolutely <laughs> crazy. Yo, I feel like if I was Freddy Fazbear, I would definitely want to live yeah. here. But yo, think about it. This is like the first place that we've seen a bunch of cars parked up in one area. Maybe this is where all the people from the town are going to live like a refugee camp because this guy's been going ballistic. Oh, dude, 100%. Yo, imagine we saw Freddy Fazbear in like a western shootout. That would be absolutely crazy. A western shootout? Dude, yeah. I'm just trying to say random things to extend the duration yeah. of this video. <laughs> what the hell is this spot? Yo, I feel like I'm in like Red Dead Redemption right now. Oh, I think I was going to far fall there. This is absolutely Kyle. nuts. Look at You're this not spot. Going to the far you think it was there. actually a real town at one point? I mean, dude, I think it's a real town right now. That's a stupid comment on my part. Winston, honestly, dude, I think you were just better off not saying a word. Yeah, probably. Yo, look how crazy this is. Okay, yo, guys, we're at 50% battery. I think we're better off taking the car to a new spot, relocating, and searching a different area because as far as I can see, we got nothing. <laughs> All right, Shorty Squad, as you can see by our surroundings, we're in a new location now. We're going to try to take the drone off again. This is attempt two at trying to find Freddy Fazbear. <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen, we have takeoff since Kyle doesn't even want to say it anymore. And ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we have takeoff. So we're in a new area. Uh, bop, 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 bop.
right off the bat. Yeah, the mountain's way over there. Yeah. So the last time we were flying the drone, we were parked way down in yeah. the distance. Oh, yeah. So we're going to try over here. We're going to probably try to take the drone around the back end of the mountain this time and try to see if we can see anything there. But guys, this is a more remote place where oh. you can see there's no town nearby. And oh, yeah. a lot of people come here for hiking and stuff. So so I was thinking to myself, if Freddy Fazbear was to be anywhere, it would probably be where there's less people around to yeah. see him in the act if he tries to like capture anybody and, and bring them back to his pizza place. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. The less witnesses, the better for him. Yeah, 100%. Oh, yeah. Okay, so... Let's let's take the drone around and I'd say our best bet is to try to follow the paths. Okay. And then look along the perimeter of the path okay, in the yeah, bushes, because yeah. that's where he could be hiding waiting to strike. That makes sense because he's probably trying to strike on people that are, you know, going on hikes, taking walks, oh, yeah. and they usually walk through the path. Yeah, Not that's mention, that's dude. literally exactly what I just said. So I don't know why the heck you're repeating things I literally <laughs> just said, David. Okay, well, you wanted me to contribute more, and honestly, it's kinda hard to contribute when I'm just looking at sand and bush. David, we're not <laughs> looking at the sand in the bushes. We're looking for a specific thing within the sand in the bushes dude you gotta snap the hell out of it dude if you're gonna get on this bounty hunting thing dude you gotta get smarter because as of right now it's not looking too good for you guys not to mention there's absolutely zero service here right now oh snap that's a like good my, point my phone literally looked oh. zero yo, 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 wait, 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 yo, 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 hold it oh my god heck? yo wait hold on guys guys oh my wait god. no that's way that's not him is it yo yo that's <gasps> wait Hold on, let me get Why are you bringing it so close? Yeah. That's Freddy Fazbear! Oh my That's goodness. That's Freddy Fazbear right there. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my you god, okay, you yo, guys. Oh my okay. god, you just made 10k. We got our eyes on the target right now. Okay, not yet, not yet. I'm sure they would pay us for this valuable footage proving that he's still lingering in the superstition area, but the $10,000 reward is if we can actually capture him. And how the hell do they expect us to do that, bro? Have you seen the size of this guy? He's huge. He's almost bigger than DK. Oh my <laughs> yeah. god. No, dude, nothing is bigger than DK. I can assure you of that. But yo, what is he doing right now? Dude, he looks that, super that mad might, at That might be yeah, DK. Look, he's like hiding, dude. I don't think he knows the drone's no, 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 on him right is, now. Let's get the drone high up so he doesn't know this because this then he knows This is just an entertainment yeah, video. Yeah, I know. What the heck? What are you doing in the day? We don't want to alert him that we're in the area because if he sees this drone, he'll probably assume it has something to do with the bounty hunters that are trying to find him. Wait, maybe we should have brought pizza to lure him, because you know, Bleh. like a pizza oh, yeah. guy. Good well, idea, yeah. Like Fazbear's Pizza Place. He's definitely out here hiding from the authorities right now. Like, look, he's behind the bush. I think, yo, this makes perfect sense. He's definitely waiting for somebody. And wait, look, there's a bunch of people down there. I think they're getting ready to hike. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, they're, he's gonna, they're gonna take attack. this path. Oh, my then he's God. gonna come out and attack them when they're not uh -oh. looking. This is actually not a good sign, pal. I mean, yo, what if he attacks someone when they're not looking? David, that is literally strike two of you saying the exact same thing I just said. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, I'll keep it down to a minimum. But, bro, we have to warn these people somehow because have you seen the movie? Have you seen what he does to these people? Dude, less talking and more thinking about what the hell we're gonna do <laughs> to sneak up on Freddy Fazbear, actually take him into custody. Custody. Look, this is actually pretty far out there. We're gonna have to walk for about 10 minutes. Why don't you just crash the drone into the ground to distract him and then we sneak up behind Monty. him and just grab him? I mean, think about it. 10k, you can buy a new drone. What the heck? Wait, hold on, hold on. Let me get, let me get nice and close with him. What the heck? Let's just stay hidden behind the bushes. It might be easier to stay behind the bushes like this rather than going up high because he can probably hear the drone. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good one. He'll make sure you stay behind the bushes and not take it high so he doesn't hear the drone. Get out. On the drone. Get out. He's done. Done, Freddy. What's he doing now? I think he's trying to find the perfect hiding spot. Okay, yo, guys. The drone is at like 5% battery. It might be worth... Wait. Yo, yo, yo. Uh-oh. Yo, Kyle, 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 Kyo. No. No. Oh, he just noticed us. He just noticed us. Oh, yo, he's super bad. He's uh, super mad. Uh, oh my oh, yeah. god. Okay, yo, the mission is compromised. Okay, yo, that would be the best time for us to get out and go on foot and try to arrest this guy. There's four of us and one of him. So I still think we have no chance, but it's worth a shot. Okay, let's go. Let's, let's go, go. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Okay, let's go. Okay, so he was over this way, right? Okay, yeah, yeah, he was over this way, yo. We have to go through this path. Dude, that's what I just said again. I'm starting to think David's the wrong guy to have with us on these missions. Yo, 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 guys, yo. Yo, I think that's him right there. Is he him? Oh, yeah, dude, 100%. That's him, that's him. Here, let me show the strawberry squad. Yo, look, he's right there. You guys see him? You see that? Strawberry squad, you guys can see him way in the distance over there. talking, over there. Let's move. Okay, yo, 
hikers. If he did see us already, he probably just thinks that we're regular hikers. So if we're gonna play this smart, we stay off the path. We gotta sneak up on him because he's probably right. suspecting anybody will come down this path. And then right. he might try to kidnap us. Hey, what's going on? This is absolutely crazy. I can't believe we're out hey, in the middle hey, of nowhere hey. hunting for Freddy Fazbear. The fact that we even caught him is insane, guys. There's literally a $10,000 reward insane. to bring him back alive. I think the sheer fact that we even just caught him is insane. And there's a $10,000 reward. Guys, everybody go to David's channel and drop a huge dislike. His link is down below oh. in the description. Hey, come on, guys. We gotta make progress before the sun goes down. The last thing we want to be doing is hunting Freddy Fazbear after nightfall. Oh, yeah. Because things can get pretty harsh out here oh, in the yeah. desert. He's right there. He's right there. He's right there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, this side. Look, we saw the drone, so we 100% suspect something right now. He knows that we're on to He's on high alert. We gotta be very careful, man. Oh, yeah. We're not successful with this. Freddy Fazbear is probably already thinking of where he's gonna go next because he knows this location is compromised now. Right. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, he's coming over this way. Do not let him see us because Freddy Fazbear is super strong. If this is really the animatronic version, four of us stand no chance. Okay. <laughs> Stay back and just keep an eye out for any other hikers and warn them not to come in the area because Freddy Fazbear's here. Okay, got it. Okay, okay. Watch behind the him. The desert can be unforgiving. And Yana, get stay him. Back there. Stay back there. Sneak up on him. We're gonna need all the men. No. <laughs> Screw this. I'm going in. All right. Three, <laughs> two, one. All right. Now, now, get him, get him. Oh, boss. You thought and you thought wrong. I'm out of here. Oh, See ya. Oh, 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 oh my goodness, David! Yo, he's running away, he's, we're losing him, guys, we're losing him, don't let him get away, come on, come on, come on, go, get him, get him, get him, don't let him get away, yo, he's running, yo, catch up to him, guys, we gotta get him, we can't let him get away, we can't let him get away, we're never gonna get that $10,000, oh my god, alright, Ah, I got him! Bring him down! Aha! Uh -huh, got him! Oh, crap, yo, somebody's caught Oh my god, we got him! Uh -huh. Guys, we actually caught the real Freddy Fazbear! This mm. is absolutely insane! We're taking him in alive! Yeah, you messed with the wrong bounty hunters, bud! Bad bear! You're going in the hole uh -huh. for a long time! Right, let's stand him up! Yeah, bad, bad animatronic bear! I wouldn't have gotten away with it if it wasn't for your meddling kids! You heard it here <laughs> first from Freddy Fazbear! All the people you you've terrorized in the middle are gonna finally you pay the price for that! The days of Freddy Fazbear and your antics are over! You got any money that's gonna pull me, stick me, stab me. <laughs> oh, my He's clear. Let's take this one in the hole. Let's do it. Uh, All right, Strawberry Squad, this is absolutely insane. <laughs> no, he's trying to get away. Uh -oh. Don't let him get Strawberry away. Squad. We got Freddy Fazbear. This is absolutely insane. That $10,000 reward is ours. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, drop hey. a like. Hit that subscribe button. <laughs> this was the first Ooh. successful bounty hunting mission. And we will see you in the next one. And as always, peace. Yeah. So, yeah, that's the end of the video. And I hope you guys like this freak film. I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like it. If you don't, then I don't care. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those notifications bell on every time I upload. And share my videos, or your videos, and other videos on your channel to your friends and videos if you want. It's your choice. Because I'm making you. Just so yeah. And don't forget to subscribe to Carl Carl Garfrey, aka Scar. I'm this channel Starmony. If you new, subscribe to this channel. If you haven't yet, subscribe. Yeah, subscribe. Subscribe if you haven't yet. And let's make sure we get on to 10. We'll be able to make sure we get to 8, 8 million subscribers and then maybe get on to 10 million subscribers as best as possible when we can. And so, yeah. And uh, and on the main channel here, we're on the road to 3K subscribers. And on the back of the channel, we're on the road to 100 subscribers. And so, yeah. And that's the inspiration film. And I'll see you all. One more banger. Banger. Banger reaction film. So I'll see you next time. And more banger content. So I'll see you next time. Super Jordan signing out. And peace out, Star Legends. And peace out, everyone. <laughs>